All right, I'm here doing my top five fishing moments of 2016. It's been a great year. Hopefully next year I'll break the seven pound mark, but this year I've caught, I caught three fish, um, over six pounds, so I'm, I'm getting closer to the seven pound mark. These are my top five fishing moments. At number five, just recently I caught a five pound catfish on a drop shot. So that is number five and here's the video. At number four, I was at the U-shaped pond in my kayak and it was early one morning. I was throwing a topwater spook type bait and I caught two bass on that one lure at the same time. So that is my number four moment. It's, I've never had that happen to me before on any lure, so it was pretty awesome to have that happen. Um, and I got it on video. So here's that video at number four. Children, no shoes on their feet. How's the people living in the street? this year over six pounds this is my second fish over six pounds it was at the pond I most recently went to that was um really rocked by the hurricane where I only caught one fish this was the second time of me fishing there this year and both times that I fished there I actually caught my personal best at the moment um, this is the first this is the second time I fished there this year and caught my second personal best. This fish was a little bit over six pounds. That was my second six pound fish of the year. That's number three.
New TV. New personal best right there. 6.88. New personal best. Hit. That's a bucket mouth. Look at that. All right. New personal best. 6.88 pounds. Let's get a release on this big fish right here. My number two moment was my is my current personal best. It's 6.99 pounds, so you might as well say seven pounds, but it is my current personal best. Um, I caught it at the Mill Pond. Um, I had a lot of success at the Mill Pond this year. I'm really hoping to have the same amount of success next year. But this is, it was caught out of my kayak. This is the my personal best for the year, 6.99 pounds. Oh my god. Uh, look at this. Look at that. Oh my god. Okay. I'm pretty sure this is my new TV. Six nine oh. Oh, that's my new PV by a couple ounces. I just want to see how long this fish is. Because this is Four inches long. So it's 24 inches long. I'm gonna give it just a touch of water and I'm gonna weigh it one more time. Alright, buddy. Okay. Alright, bud, I'm gonna weigh you one more time, then I'm letting you go, okay? I'm shaking. It's a big fish. Really thought I was gonna break the seven today. Nine nine, still saying six nine nine, so that's what I'm gonna go with. Alright, alright, buddy, I'm gonna put you back. Alright, so make sure the camera's on real quick. Yep, the camera's on. Alright. New personal best. Right here. Look at this. 
That right there is a fish. Alright. Let me take a picture with my phone real quick. Alright, buddy. Get the release. Of this bad boy right here. My number one fishing moment of 2016 was the first time that I caught a fish over six pounds and it just so happens I was at the pond that I went to recently that I didn't have much luck at that um, got messed up by the hurricane and I caught in back-to-back -back casts fish over five pounds. I caught two fish, two casts, one was a little over five and the other one was about six and a half pounds. So that was a pretty, and it happened really early in the year. So it was pretty awesome to have those two catches on the same day, back-to-back -back cast. But that is definitely my number one moment of 2016. Here's that video. No! Oh my gosh! No! Oh no! 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 Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh my God! No! It ain't the same one! No! Come on! Come on! Ah! That's what I'm talking about! Oh my God! Where's my? Where's my? I need my pies. Where the pies at? Where's her? Oh my god! Holy crap! Oh my god! Oh, this has been caught before. Looks like.
to the top of nigga, you can't stop. <laughs> Over six pounds. Yep. Six, six, six. I got you, buddy. I'm putting you up. I'm gonna put you back. Let me get some water on him. Boy, don't you dare. I'm not letting you go yet. You don't even think about it. I'm just trying to think y'all. All right. Oh, take a couple. has been a pretty good year um, like I said I started my channel in May so it's been about seven months it's been it's been a great seven months I've really enjoyed it I enjoy making the videos I enjoy editing the videos but mainly I just like getting out of fishing I'm hoping 2017 was as good to me as 2016 was hopefully I'll get out in the boat more um, catch a bunch of fish off the boat as well as still being out the kayak have a couple of mounts um, that I'm thinking about for the cameras in the kayak that I'm going to do over the winter. I'm going to make an adjustment to my seat over the winter and just some things like that. But I really hope 2017 um, is better than 2016. Um, coming up on 700 subscribers and in seven months, that's pretty awesome. Um, I want to thank you guys for being great subscribers. Um, you, you really, there's a, a group of you that really comment a lot on my videos and I really appreciate it and you're the main reason why I do the giveaways I have a 600 um, no a 700 subscriber giveaway coming soon so as soon as that happens I will be building towards the 1000 subscriber giveaway which will be a little bit bigger giving away a reel some other stuff so things to look forward to in 2017 already Thank you guys for being great subscribers. If you are watching this and you have not subscribed, please do so. Hit the thumbs up if you like the video. Hope you guys liked my top five fishing moments of 2016. If I didn't include one you liked, please put that in the description. And you never know, it may be that I forgot about a moment, but these, I feel like these are my top five. If you have a moment that you like, you can add that in the description in the, in the comments. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good night.